what is a big sit? Well, in the bird world, we like to go out and, and count birds and find as many birds as we can. And there's all kinds of different manifestations of this from the big year where you try to go out and see as many birds in a year, whether it's in your state or the whole country. There are big days where you try to go out and see as many species in a single day as you can. And of course, with a big sit, as the name implies, you're not doing too much moving. We are uh, literally sitting on this little eight foot by six foot deck and we are counting every single species that we can. We're out on a platform that's out on a sandbar that splits Long Island Sound from an 840 acre marsh so we've got a pretty good field of view and uh, quite a varied habitat. We came out here long before sunrise and we'll be out here after sunset trying to literally not miss a single bird and it's actually uh, a fundraiser for uh, the for Connecticut Audubon for the Coastal Center here. So we either get pledges by this number of species we see, or they can give us you know five dollars, ten dollars, two hundred dollars, whatever they want to give us. But uh, we raise money to uh, support the Coastal Center. Look offshore, and you'll see there two you sticks. He's looking right at where it should be. Almost. You're looking about right at where it is offshore. This event was started by John Himmelman, who was from the New Haven Bird Club. And he was sitting around one day thinking, you know, he, there's that expression, if you stay in one place long enough, all, all the, you can see all the birds in the world. And he thought, well, let's put it to the test. And uh, we did the first big sit together here and have been doing it ever since at Milford Point. And they like doing it. They, they really enjoy trying to beat last year's record and uh, just a labor of love. Um, and if you see it, let me know. There's a small duck landed in there somewhere. About four minutes ago, three minutes ago. You know, drawing attention to the birds at this place hopefully will help give an example to the public of what amazing areas we have, but also sort of the fact that we need to be conscious when we're out using public areas that they can also be uh, incredibly important places for other organisms as well.